exciting. We have a word problem here. This one asks us, uh, at a sale this week, a Michael Kors bag is on sale for $258.40. This is a 62% discount off of the original price. What is the original price? Okay, so a couple steps we're going to have to do on this problem is that we have an original price not known of the Michael Kors bag. So let's call that X to say we don't know what that is. Now it gets discounted, subtracted by 62% of the cost of the bag. So this right here would represent the cost of the bag. The 0.62X represents 62% of the price of the bag, which is supposed to be subtracted off in order to give us the sale price. And the sale price, as stated in the problem, is 258.40. Okay, now, on the left-hand side, let's collect our like terms. 1 minus 0.62 would be 0.38. Keep the x equals 258.40. You can actually think of this mentally if you think about the fact that when you reduce something by 62%, you retain 38%. That's another place you can see that 0.38 occurring from. At any rate, now to figure out what our present is, what our original price is, let's divide both sides by 0.38, and so we will end up yielding on the left-hand side the variable x, which represented our original unknown price, and on the right-hand side we have 258.4 divided by 0.38, which seems to be $680. So it appears as though the price of the bag before the discount was $680. Just mentally, half of 680 is 340, and the price is lower than 340, so a 62% discount is consistent with this answer. It's in the right ballpark. Okay, so try this one on your own then. A pair of Tory Burch shoes are on sale for $191.40, which is 33% of the original. What is the regular price? Now, assuming you set this up and tried it on your own, let's do it together. A little bit of a wrinkle that makes it different than our last problem. Let X be the original price. And this problem says this time that the X, or that the price that we're given, the 191.40, is 33% of the original. So unlike the other problem where we had to perform a subtraction because it told us the discount, this one they just tell us what percentage of the original it is, and so our equation has changed slightly. No need for subtraction. However, we still need to divide, divide both sides by 0.33, and it looks like we're going to get a final answer of x equals 191.4 divided by 0.33, which is $580. Again, as a ballpark, 580 is pretty close to 600. A third of 600 is around 200, so this looks like it's in the right ballpark, and it is the correct answer.